Hey guys, Bubble Pop Kids here and it is Squishy Chopping Saturday. Let's do this. Can't believe it, the time flies. I don't know where the time goes you guys. We did a Squishy Chopping Wednesday and now it is Saturday. I got new stuff on the chopping block. Let's take a look. Bubble, are you serious? Is this like the Squishy Chopping Baby Show with your little baby bubble? Y'all crazy. We are just gonna jump on into it, start chopping, start squishing. Let's just take a quick little look, see what we have. So these, oh, they are so cute. Little mini baby bottle slimes. I got blue. Look how cute. I can't even read it, but it looks super slimy. It looks like ooze. And that little guy is so cute. He looks like Pac-Man. And I couldn't just get one of those little cuties. I got this dark blue, we got some red, and original green slime color. These are gonna be cute. My best friend, neighbor, and squishy maker, Colleen. She is still away in Tokyo. She's in Japan right now. But my little cousin, Stephanie, has taken over. And she made me two homemade stress balls to chop open today. Can't wait. They are squish. What is this? Is this like squishy candy bubble? And the final two little things that we're gonna be looking at today are, ooh, look at this. I had one of these. I think I had something similar to it, but not this exact one. It is a color change putty. It goes from orange to yellow. I just love anything color change. So that's gonna be cool to see if it actually works. And I got this little jelly ball. Look at that. Feels so cool. It looks like it's liquid, but it's completely solid. And I'm gonna put my little polka dots, slice it up. Oh, uh, get to the chopping, get to the chopping, okay. And always worry about your little squishy teens. If you guys are ever gonna cut your squishy toys at home, just make sure you have an adult or a parent supervising, cause you don't know what's in these and the scissors can be sharp and dangerous. So what do you guys say we get started right now? Come on. Bubble, you have to start with the Stephanie homemade because it's got a big bubble and a baby bubble to pop. Love that. Taking off the show with a Stephanie homemade. Stephanie is my little cousin. She is so cute. She's like the cutest little girl ever. She makes slime. She makes squishies. She even started making the little kawaii ones with the memory foam. I don't know how she does it. She dropped these off to me yesterday and ever since I've been like, what is in her mystery squishy? It's so, so squish. It feels like there's little chunky pieces and I love it. It's got these orange and like a yellow swirl. Looks like a planet or something, it's so cute. Ooh, it's crunchy too. Love it. I squished it, I squished it a lot. And you guys, I just cannot figure it out. I feel something crunch. I feel some kind of slime or putty. Let's pop it. Let's see what she did to this. Bubble, bubble. This one is a little scary. Like, what exactly is popping out of here? No way. Stephanie, you little cutie pie, I love you. She's probably watching this right now and looking at me open her slime. You guys, look at this. She made a seashell glitter slime. Whoa. I don't even, I've actually never thought of anything like this. Like how could those little shells, cause they're kind of heavy, stick inside of this glue and slime mixture. But they actually do, whoa. Look at that. Look at the gold glitter. Unreal. Bubble, I am literally going to 
what you call this? The Little Mermaid Putty. It reminds me of Ariel. Look at all those shells. Let me pop one out of here. It's beautiful. In my last video, Stephanie made me like this homemade pearl slime. Oh, this is just as beautiful. It's so pretty. It's sparkly. It almost looks like it washed up in the water, like on the shore. It looks like a little jellyfish with some shells in there. It is so cool. It's so squish. It's stretchy. It's got a billion little shells. Different sizes, different colors. Where did she find these little babes? They are so tiny. Ooh, it's like a snail shell. Look at that. Yeah, they could just stare at this for hours. I mean, there's so many little shells in here. I've never seen some of these. Maybe they're from like Florida. I'm gonna ask her where she got them. Ooh, look at that one, it's kind of pointy. And I saw, look at this, so pretty. It's like little pieces of jewels, these little shellies. Ooh, what else? I saw so many different ones. Ooh, look at that, it's like a pearly. It's like a little pearly snail shell. Pop some of these itty bitty little shells out of that slot and look how cute they are. They're such a variety. They are just so super miniature. They almost look fake, but for sure they are real. They are so real. I love them. Guys, mystery solved. Squisher number one had some seashell slime. Loved it. Move it along. <laughs> and just when you thought it couldn't get any cuter, they put out these little baby bottle slimes. Look how cute they are. They had a ton of colors. I picked out this blue, red, and green. Ooh, look at that. It's such a crazy blue. And it looks so oozy and slimy in there. Wish I could read it. <laughs> Bubble, I think it says Pac-Man baby bottle slime. Or baby juice. I think it's a baby juice. And I kept thinking, these look like little baby milk bottles. They're actually little baby juicy bottles. They have some juicy slime. And there's nothing left to do but pop this out of here and see how it squishes. Let's do it. That is some jiggly. You know, not only is this so amazing, you guys, it is scented. Oh, and it's kind of clear. I have never seen a slime with that like translucency. Smells like blueberries. It smells like a blueberry juice or some kind of like a fruit punch. Woo! That's crazy. So, it jiggles. The jiggle is beyond crazy. And the color is so like clear. It's clear blue. Poke it. it turns into crunchy jelly. These are just so adorable because when you pop out that slime, it looks like a little baby food jar that is so cute. And let's go for the red. Ooh, this is some like <laughs> strawberry or fruit punch. Let's see if it smells. Woo! Oh, this looks like pomegranate juice. Let me smell. Look at my little juicer here. I definitely have had something along these lines. I think it was called like blood putty. It looks so, so similar, but I don't think it was as red as this. This is like a deep red jiggly slime. It is perfect. Woo, it is so cool to squish. Eee. Move my red to the back so I don't mix it with the green. Now this green one is so cool. It is like the ultimate slime. It's like the Nickelodeon slime color. I love this little top here, it matches. 
and I'm sure it's gonna be so similar. Woo, of course it's the same. Yeah, bubble, but this one, this one smells like fish. Ugh. Gotta plug my nose with this one. Ooh, it smells like fried fish. Doesn't smell too great, but it does the job. If you're bored, you need a little something to squish on. There it is. You can mix with the red a little bit. Still good. Push of things, number two. I definitely have to go back and get more colors. I think they had like yellow, pink, and purple. They even have like little swirly ones. These are the cutest. Move along. It literally looks like a gigantic Orby. It's an Orby. All teens, we are on to the third one. And oh, I love it. It's super tiny, but you know it actually does look like an Orby. Except if you smushed on an Orby like this, it would completely break apart. This thing stays intact. It's so cool. Look like at a little bag of jelly. You know it looks like a little bag of honey. Pop it out of here. I'll pop it out of here, Bubba. That. Wow. And when I look at it up close, you know what it looks like? A soccer ball. It's got those little soccer ball, little hexagons or whatever they are on there. And so squish. I think this is what they call solid ooze. After twirling and squishing this thing, you guys, it is all distorted. It looks kind of weird and bumpy, but oh, so, so cool. They have these in so many different colors. The only way to describe it, it kind of feels like I have jelly, like a grape, or not a grape, like a strawberry jelly. And I'm squishing it, but my hands don't get dirty. Ooh, it smells like glue, though. Yeah, it's just chocolate butter. So it's going to be nice. So shiny. My little jelly ball. It's in a billion little pieces, but it is still so cool. I bet it would stick right back together. It is just so sticky. It's like a little sticky ball. Love it. Yeah. I cannot believe it. We are on our second to last. And you know it. A Stephanie homemade. My little Steffi found some super cute balloons. Ooh, this one looks like galaxy. Look at that. All those colors. This one's crunchy too. In three, two, one, here goes. Ooh, <laughs> it's pink. No, <laughs> she is so cute. Look at this, you guys. She put little alphabet beads. Let me just get the rest on out of here. Oh, this is so cute. Such a difference. She made that sparkly, kind of clear seashell. And then she went for a little pop of color with these pretty little beads. Look at that. It's like bubble gum. 
Ooh, it's crunchy. I don't know which one I like better, the seashell crunchy one or the little alphabet beads. This one is so super cute. The other one was just like beautiful. It looked like it came straight from the ocean. And it is just so amazing, look at that. Unreal how those beads just stick right in there. doesn't get better than that as far as slime. Woo, that was so good. Let's move on to the final. It is color change putty. Oh, lucky never get it right. It is magic, heat reactive, color changing, orange to yellow. Not your ordinary. Gotta have it, out of this world. Woo, that's a song twister. Ever since I got this, I think I even got it at like five below. I've been so curious. Is it gonna work? Ooh, look at that. Orange. Ooh, it's not a little baggy. And when they say putty, they are not joking. You guys, this is nothing like the slime we've been looking at. It's a little bit firmer and tough. Let's see if it does this color change. And my hands are so warm right now, so it really should work. is amazing it actually did the trick it turned yellow this is so cool it looks like mustard and the only thing I can compare this to is that crazy Aaron's thinking putty although I like this a lot more it's a lot less expensive I think it was like four bucks and it works so good it's stretchy it's twisty love it and I'm so curious if I'll leave it out if it's gonna go back to orange but let's see At the end of the show, my testing table is looking lovely. I love every single thing on here. My favorites, of course, were Stuffy's homemade stress balls. They were so cute. Oh yeah, well I like the little red jelly ball that you destroyed. It's a wrap, hope you enjoyed it guys. And if you liked the video, don't forget to leave a nice comment down below and click that like button.